Hey everyone, welcome to Higan Iruthil. So it's time for your pre-download and it's available already if you are in Singapore, Malaysia, and Canada. But if you do not belong in these countries, you may try. Okay, I'm just going to tell you this outright. You may try to download the Google Play Store in those um, countries. And um, you can try to download the game from there. Okay, um, it's not impossible um, to play this game for soft launch. Uh, it's just that you'll have to, you know, do some research on how to download the game for the soft launch. So for Singapore, Malaysia and Canada, you can download the game. It was already allowed earlier. So this was up at 11 GMT plus 8. And um, we have here uh, on display Armand. So again, guys, uh, the, the meaning of pre-download is you can download the game today, but um, you can actually still you have to play it on February 23rd. It's just a pre-download, meaning uh, at least on the 23rd, you won't have any problem um, downloading it anymore. You'll be playing it automatically once the servers are live. Okay, so I'm just going to be going through a couple of um, characters um, just to have um, just to remind you guys of, of who the notable characters are. Who you're gonna be re-rolling for? I'm gonna do a extensive re-roll guide anyway. Um, when the when when the soft launch uh, comes in, but again, um, at least the, I'll I'll refresh your memory on who are most notable, who you don't want to get based on my experiences in the CBT. Take note that um the tier lists the tier list that I'm going to be presenting is not updated i've researched through a lot of tier lists and ha i haven't seen an updated one when they added new characters armand is not even um added there and she even is a good character so let's move on to that tier list and see whether um some of the some of the characters there are familiar to you and some might be new to you okay so we will start with uh this is actually by pocket gamer so so far i think uh they have the you know it's more of a short um description of what they have all of the characters or all of the heroes are the same with the other tier list not the updated one for the last cbt but i'll do my best to at least uh jog your memory in terms of who is good and uh, and if i agree with their tier list so more or less um this is for tier c so asa celia and ume they're you know bottom of the, of, of the tier i don't think you'll be um re-rolling for them so let's move on to tier b these ones are worth getting but not for the reroll especially for roko roko is a good healer to have so i used roko um during the cbt um siakom is also one that is actually nice to have but again they're not on the top tiers okay moving on to tier a so i think this is up to tier s so for tier a these are your secondaries if you don't have um, characters in tier A. So the ones that I think are good here that I have used is Fanny. She she has actually a good... Um, she, she is ranged, by the way. Um, good damage, good AoE damage as well. Queen is a assassin. Um, not, so not so good. I think she's in the middle in terms of damage. Um, there's going to be a better assassin from her, but she is actually good to have. Um, who else did I use here? Euphoria, I did. Uh, but Isa, Isa, not so much. Um, probably, probably, um, Isa is going to be, uh, she's a, she's a caster. So debuffs. Euphoria is going to be hoplite. So shield. And Fen, as I've said, uh, AoE attacks deals a lot of burst damage. So for here, the best ones to get for tier A is going to be Fen and Queen. Then moving on to your tier S. Um, these are the must-haves. But for the five here that I mentioned, Chlora, Chlora is easy to get. She is lower rarity. Uh, not the top rarity. Not S. I'm not sure if rank A. 
she's not the top you know top rarity so it's easier to get lower so screamer easier to get as well the ones that i think you should focus on is these three uh gildan is the best um tank or defender that uh the game has this is gildan um Iluya will be the best assassin that you can get so if you want a very high damage assassin then Iluya deals a lot of burst damage deals massive damage Iluya and Surslet is um she's not she's not an assassin but she is I think a warrior type so very good DPS as well so for the first CBT my main DPS was Surslet for the last CBT it was Iluya so both of them I used if you if you plan to re-roll guys um Surslet and Iluya is actually the way to go so Gildan if you fancy a defender then go for Gildan but again primary re-roll target will be Surslet and Iluya I can't vouch for the new characters I I really haven't um seen much I used Arman uh, I had terrible luck in pulling for the new characters added on the last CBT but so far for this tier list and anyway guys I'm gonna up the I'm gonna be updating um I'm gonna be putting out an updated tier list as soon as characters are available and I am able to test them out I'll be putting out a more detailed tier list but at first glance you won't regret it if you get Iluya or Seriously that's just it uh if you're going after a reroll or just uh, looking for a good DPS character. So that is it, guys. Just this is just a reminder, a probably another, you know, another um, uh, additional information, just in case you are, you know, you are waiting for more information on characters on how to start. I'll be putting out a lot of videos on day one, especially on team build, which you really need because once you get your first, you know, good character, then you want to figure out who you want to put around them the team build the basic the beginner team build and also um the next one would be fast progression how to progress fast through this game even if you're free to play okay guys so thank you very much for staying this far take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here